Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying the limited edition Swedish Fish Oreo cookies. Yes, they're real. <laughs> they do exist. They do exist. Two cookies are 140 calories. Um, it's, it's from what I have read all over the internet, these are a Kroger exclusive. So you all will have to tell me if you see them in any other store other than Kroger, let me know. Kevin stopped in a different town and bought these and they were- $2.99. $2.99. Which is expensive for 20 cookies. There's only 20 cookies in the package, but a lot of these limited edition cookies mm. only have 20 in the package. Now, for people maybe across the pond, somebody that's never had Swedish fish, and they're at home going, what in the world is that? Swedish fish is kind of a, a strawberry licorice kind of, I mean a strawberry, uh, kind of like a Twizzlers or a... It's a... Kind of. it's, and it's shaped like, it looks like... Cool. They look like fish, they're, they're, they're like a gummy, but they're a hard, they're a tough, they're, they're a very tough gummy. It's like a, it's like a licorice stick. So... There's a very red dye. Yes. Can you hold that up? I will hold this up because I mean it is like super red. It's like a pot of paint. And I will have a close up at the uh, at the end of the video. And they have enough filling in like double stuff, so mm -hmm. almost a double stuff, maybe not quite. This is a, that does taste like Swedish fish. That's a decent flavor. It's kind of chemically. It's like a berry flavor. Then you get Swedish fish kind of taste mm -hmm. chemically. It's like a berry flavor to me. Like a blueberry, raspberry, strawberry, all the cherry, those... all these berries mixed in. Yeah, che even cherry. Yes, there's cherry in there as well. The and honestly, now, now that you said that, the cherry's probably stronger that's than any That's what I smelled. Other. When I first opened it, that's uh -huh. what it smelled like. Yeah, the cherry is the strongest flavor in there. I think that's a good cookie. Try just the cream. Ooh. Just scrape some off your teeth. Just the cream. Just scrape it off your teeth. Now, it's different. It's not as... Uh, it goes better with the chocolate, but it's not bad. It's a, oh no, it's not bad at all. It's not. It's on the border between, you know, you have a teeter totter, and it's on the border of uh, being candy and medicinal. It's like right yeah. there, you know. But when I say chemically, that's what I kind of medicinal. Mean, so. yeah. yeah, yeah. But it, I think it is right there. I think it's good. I, they're good. It's not something I buy all the time. They're not as good as the limited edition, those fruity pebble ones. Those were awesome. Those are good. What yeah. were the, yeah, those are really those good. Those were really good. The lemon ones are the best ones ever. Um, those were at Meyer, the, or we bought them at Meyer. those fruity ones. Yeah. Um, there's another kind I had recently that was really good. They've had blueberry. They've no, had so like a, um, many. They had a cinnamon, cinnamon roll. The cinnamon roll. That cinnamon roll good. were awesome. Yeah, they yeah. Were really good. If you can still find those and you haven't tried them, you should try them. Um, These are good though. Definitely worth trying out. Yes, you you have to try them. Um, I think they're worth two ninety nine. I mean, this is. Um, it might, this might be the only time these are out and they might never come around again. So I think you ought to uh, try them and see what you think. And they did accurately capture a Swedish fish. Yeah, fish. they did. They really did do a good job. So I know Kevin showed you a close up, but I'm going to have a close up for you at the end. And I hope you can find them in your area. If you enjoyed the video, please give us a thumbs up and thanks for watching.